Hey everybody, welcome back to the Pirate 101 Wooden Sword Challenge, where I intend to beat the game Pirate 101 with a wooden sword. I believe this is episode 9, and we're making our way through the gold mine right now. It has been about two weeks since I've played this game, so I'm probably going to be a little bad today, but I was going to be a little bad anyway. Um, but yeah, I'm hoping we'll get done with the gold mine today. It really depends on how long this all takes. It shouldn't be that bad. You are Pretty short area. We'll start off today with the good old boss fight. <clears throat> Just to get ourselves warmed up. Let's see. Where are you at? I'm going to wait for you to move up a bit. Yeah, I can't even reach you. Okay. Um, we'll go right here. Yeah. Yeah. But yeah, it's been a while since I've played this game. I took a little break. Took a little breather. So if I make any mistakes, that's going to be my excuse. But I hope y'all are doing well today. I'm doing all right. Um, you know, just just chilling, chilling like a villain. I think that's the appropriate term. All right. Ooh, Haku, Haku, Haku. Dang gonna hurt me more. So I think I'm gonna wait. Oh, really? Uh, in that case, we'll go for it then. We just need to defeat him, so, and then I think another guy spawns. I'm okay with taking this little damage. See, look at that. Look how much we did. It worked out. We do have a couple good fights coming in today, though. I'm looking forward to. Okay. Wait, do y'all have Witch Hunter? No. Alright, cool. We'll do that. We'll save Ratbeard's epic. I'm not too worried about this fight. Oh, I forgot about Cheap Shot. See, I'm already making mistakes. Already making mistakes. Rise, ancient ones. Rise and help us. Go on, rat. Okay, um, alright, it's just this guy. I don't think I do any damage to him, but I think he has Overwatch, so yeah, let's knock out one of those while our guys are coming up. <clears throat> Get rid of a cheap shot as well. Okay. Yeah, forgot. I don't do any damage. The whole purpose of this walkthrough. Don't, don't do any damage. I need to keep close to the companions, too. Just to make sure I don't mess up in any way. Or that I can heal them. Alright. Fan. Come on, girl. You can make it. She doesn't want to. <clears throat> oh. Alright. I'm gonna heal Fan because Bonnie can hit that little bomb. I mean, just awful placement on your part, buddy. As you wish. And it might be GG, honestly. Oh, wait. Rapbeard, you go over here so your blade storm hits him. And then it should be GG. Okay. That didn't help. That'll help, though. <clears throat> okay. How much do we do? Not bad at all. Rapid D, can you do enough to finish this off? Yes, he can. Good job. Good job, team. Not that bad at all. 
And I hope I left the mark, because this guy was pretty far. Uh, where's the... There it is. Okay. The old ones, they poisoned my mind. I did leave a mark. Good for me. Yeah, like I said, it's been... I would say two weeks. Maybe like a week and a half since I last played this game. I just needed a little breather. But at least I recorded ahead. Work, worked out. Okay, campsite time. Campsites. Yep, we're already done with the gold mine. Now we're going on to the dark jungle. Which is probably the longer area of this entire island. And that's not even saying much. But, yeah, we should make good progress today. Because I want to... I don't want to just have it be like a short episode. Because it doesn't take that long to get to Gortez. So if we can get to him, that'd be cool. Alright. This is the dark jungle. Not a bad area. A lot of interesting fights here. I think a few promotion quests take, take you this way, too. I know some of uh, the Witch Doctor quests. Um, I think the Witch Doctor quest that gives you one of your abilities takes you out here. Auto. What's up, buddy? Oh no, Ramos. Okay, Rumble in the jungle. Okay, we might level today? That'd be cool. Oh, how am I doing on the funky bunches? Pretty good, pretty good. I gotta remember to get the one in the cave. We have to defeat six? I was kind of just thinking to myself, um, Bonnie's a little bit of a low level, and we are about to do the boss fight of the Dark Jungle, or one of the big fights of the Dark Jungle. That Troggy's just laying there, man. So we are fight, about to fight the big Troggy boss, um, so I'm trying to debate whether I should level up Bonnie or not. I think she'll be okay. I hope she'll be okay. Um, I'll just play it safe here. Because Fane's a bit of a low level too, but I'm not, I'm pretty stingy when it comes to training points. Or companion home training points, I mean. So I think we'll be okay. But, you know, just thinking to myself. Oh, what's this? Subida already done? Okay. We gotta get our nautical XP up, because we're at level 5, and I'd like to be a little higher. I know they reduced the requirements. I think they, like, halved how much it takes for each level, which is really nice, because that was always a problem. Well, it was a problem before they did the companion task. Now with the task, it's not a super big issue. But before then, that was a bit of a lag spike right there. But uh, before then, it was pretty difficult to... Uh, get nautical XP, or it took a lot of time. But yeah, we're about to do a good old fight. A good old fun fight. Shouldn't be that bad. I don't think that this fight's super tough. I think the Gortez fight's going to give us more of an issue. But we'll still stay on al alert. Where's the funky bunch? Isn't up here? Yeah. My god, what's with the lag? Oh no. Probably doing too much. Anyway. Let's do this fight. Oh man, I'm just getting memories. I did this fight 25 times on my Witch Doctor to get this guy. We'll rock with this crew. I'm just having memories of doing this fight. It's so irritating. Um, bonfires first, of course. Wait, can I reach the other one? I can't even reach the other one, are you kidding me? Well, well then in that case, Bonnie, you go up here. Right here, you go right there. We're gonna have to take some damage for a little bit. Damn, I forgot about the parting shot. And ready to spell. Fan's not looking good already. 
We got two musketeers we gotta deal with. Shouldn't be as bad. Since yeah, we should be okay with the musketeers. <clears throat> okay. So now that this is gone, do we have a witch hunter? No. We got this. I don't even think we even need to do. I'm gonna have you go over there. Bonnie, you start working on them. Rapper, you get this. So for this whole fight, you really just need to attack the boss. You don't need to attack anybody else because he has a cheat. This is the one. I think this. I wouldn't say the first cheating boss. I think Chuba Wumba kind of. I would say Chuba Wumba counts as a cheating boss. This is our first look at a a decent cheating boss, at least. Um. Yeah. I'm doing stuff in the background, so I'm not really paying attention, but I'm not super worried. Um, okay, let us do that. Let's do that. Rapier can't even get across, okay. Hopefully he gets rid of the one of these guys. That's in the way. See, sacrifice, gets rid of that Troggy Hunter. Every time he gets to half health, he'll do that. So you just keep doing that until he has no minion. Then you just kill him. That's why buffing doesn't even matter here. You just want to attack. Come on, Bonnie. Oh, man, I should have healed Fan. Please don't die. Thank you. Okay, I'll heal Fan. You go him. Ratbeard, you move up. Yeah. And we should be done with two minions there. If all works out. Fan should be able to last. Okay, thank you, Fan. Oh, man. Bonnie's gonna get up. Oh, come on, Bonnie. At least one minion's down. Give me that beard. That's gonna hurt. You need a Mojo Rising, too? Yeah. another one of these for fan we've still got we got another heal with bonnie so should be fine i just don't want any i don't know if any other minions spawn if it takes a certain amount of rounds oh my god fan land a hit bonnie you have burst fire use it thank you Sorry, Tick Tick. Alright. You know what? Let's just get involved. Let's go for it. He won't be dead this round unless it works out, but who knows? Look at me. I'm already dodging. Didn't work. Thank you, fan, for landing a hit. Bonnie. This is where Bonnie goes in. Right here. Thank you, Bonnie. That's why I built you this way. Aw. Oh. No more minions, thankfully, and that should be GG. See, not a bad fight. Not a bad fight at all. Alright. Got anything good? Nothing too crazy. Alright. What's going on here? Gold, not too bad. We have to defeat and collect. Okay. Um, this fight's not going too bad at all. Trollies aren't that hard to beat, so I don't really show these. And we fought them before. These guys are just a little stronger than the last ones we did. But, you know, they're nothing too special. Alright, Fan might be able to finish her finish him by himself. By herself. I don't know what the gender of these Trogis are. I'm assuming guys just from the loincloth, but you know. If they're like one of these fighter societies, or like hunter-gatherer societies, aren't, aren't the guys normally the ones that go out and kill things? I'm assuming. Uh, Crimson Lotus, okay. Oh, something fell outside. 
Okay. Um, third one, third one, third one. Any of them that are ooh, too risky. This is too risky, but I'm going for it. All right. We're making a really good progress today. Oh man, I'm checking an email at the same time as playing this game. I'm impressed with myself right now. Woo! Alright, cool, cool, cool. Sorry about that. I had to check some emails for work. But we're, we're good. Fast reading. And we're already in the ancient ruins. We're making so much good progress today. Can we just level? Do we level from talking to you? <laughs> Do we get any... I'm trying to think if swashbucklers get a companion. We do! We do get a companion! That's right! I forgot, I forgot we get a companion after we're done with Gortez, so that's really gonna be helpful. I don't think he's good, but you know, he'll be good for right now. Give us a little bit of a level boost. I don't like these notifications, so if y'all notice, I'll click through them like crazy. Um, but we leveled. So let's see, can we get you to 11? No. Can we get you to 11? No. Oh, what about you? I'll play order. I don't care. It doesn't take that long to do these. We'll get you to 11. Oh, I'll put you ahead of Jack Russell. Go back to sailing. Bonnie should be able to get to 11. Sweet. And I think that's good. Well, Scratch is 11, but we should be fine there. Where do we have to go? Should leave a mark right here. I think we're fighting some armada guys. It makes sense since we're around a bunch of them. But yeah, this is we're making a lot of progress today. Um, let's see. Defeat six. As I was doing the last fight, these guys gave me something so disgusting. They gave me a weapon, and I'll show you it. I'll show you it after this fight. But it was just so gross, and I had to let you know about it. Disgusting. Wow, I thought I was a lot further along in this fight than I really am. Um, let's do that. Yeah. That sounds good. Bonnie, you were supposed to kill. Now you're making me look bad. You're making me look like I don't know how to play the game. Okay, can we... Can we calm down? I'm actually gonna have to use a heal in a mob fight? Oh my god. I am just looking so bad. Honey, you're there. Rat breed, you're there. Please just end it. Thank you. Just keep going. Alright, and we should get a double tap. 98, not bad. Okay, thank you. I'm not bad at the game, I just get. I get overconfident in my ability. What the heck is this? What? Well, I hope I don't get pulled. But what? It's just gross. I mean, I'm a pacifist, okay? I don't get this off my screen. I'm a pacifist. I don't appreciate all these weapons being thrown at me. I'm have. I'm here trying to just spread joy and spread love, you know. These guys just don't like it. They don't appreciate it. Intruder, you will identify Ooh, boss fight. And surrender. Comply or be I thought we were going to get pulled by the Marine. <laughs> I really did think. Ooh, boy. Alright, I think this guy has a bomb. Where's he at? This guy. Not too bad. Dang, we need a range on this thing. I'm going to move up because, you know, we got a ways to go. This is a large battlefield. Oh, man. Huge battlefield. Okay. I think it was a defeat all. We got a whiles to go. Oh my god, why are they so far away? It is a defeat all. Can I hit this guy at least? Cool. Okay. Do that. They might be able to hit us. I just want them to move in a little bit. At least we crit on the boss. 
-hmm. Okay. See, their range is crazy. Um, let's get rid of those two. Or work on those two at least. You work on those two. Rapbeard, you get rid of him. I probably should have had Rapbeard go for the sniper. I probably could have killed the sniper. Oh well. He might kill this guy. He might kill one guy at least. Okay, or not. That's cool. He has a heal too? Okay, this guy's good. Is he better than Gortez? He might be better than Gortez. Um, I don't need to heal anybody right now. I can't really do much, so... You finish him. Bonnie, you go for him. And Rapier, see if you can finish the Marine. You got one down. Well, we don't have one down. Are you kidding me? Are we just bad? Oh. Really no flanking? I thought flanking would have automatically been triggered. Okay. Um, I guess I probably should start healing people. Bonnie, you're the lowest. Do y'all have parting shot or anything like that? No. Alright, you have a quick draw too. You get this sniper. Rap beard, you finish the marine. Just because I don't know if Monty's going to hit the marine. Alright, I'm surprised Bonnie hit the marine. I thought she was going to go for the boss. Okay, this guy needs to chill out. Oh my god. <clears throat> Can we kill any of you guys? You're at 93. Who's at the lowest health? Chan or, uh, not Chantal, Fan. Uh, Y'all get rid of him while well, Fan's working on the boss. Why is this guy doing so much to us right now? Keep going. Should be GG. Look at me going in for a mega. Yeah! Good one, Bonnie. Clockwork Basher, okay, cool. Let's go to the Ancient Ruins. Oh, there's a chest over there, I should have gone for it. Talk to Aguirre. Okay, um... You know what? Full send, let's go. Let's go for it. What do we get? We get a companion. We get a good amount of XP. I think we're gonna just go for it. Let me head back to Skull Island real quick. I think we should be good with a... Oh, for, for this fight, I'm going to get Fan to 11. Yes, Captain. Just because this is a pretty big fight. Um, let me go to Skull Island, see if I can get anything new from our trainer. Don't know if we can, but that'd be cool. Um, let's go. We're a swashbuckler, right? Yeah. Okay. Do we have anything new? Walk in darkness might be helpful. Dodgy. That gallant defense might actually be useful with the way we use this guy. That may be very useful later on. I probably won't use it, but it might might be helpful. But yeah, we're just gonna go into it. Um, this is probably gonna go poorly. Uh, I will let you know. 
I'm going to upload all the failures to. So, I don't know if I'll do the full failures, I'll probably just do the part, right, the end bit. But, as of right now, this is my first try, first attempt going for it. We have two tough fights here. Uh, the first one probably is going to be really fun. That one's going to be really fun. Especially with Walk in Darkness and everything like that. Um, we have to fight Ordaz. And that's a solo, so I have no companions there. I'm going to have to use the battle board to my advantage. More than anything. Because he does have a lot of... What are they? Barrels here. So I need to get him in an ideal spot. Like where he is right now. To blow up these barrels. So if I can get the... Right off the bat now. Um, I wanted to save that. Hold on. That's not going to do enough damage. Shoot. I'm going to risk this. Because I think that the barrels will do more damage than this attack would anyway. So, as much as I would like to use that on him. Damn, I, I probably should have used that on him. Let's see how much damage we end up doing to him. Decent amount. So now we have to bait him over here. Can we get over here? Yeah, let's go over here. Shoot, will we be able to do enough? Alright, now we go for this. I don't know if we'll be able to do enough. I have 53, 40, another 40. He's pretty low. Okay, we're gonna lead him over here. Can we do any damage to this? I didn't even check what his PA is. Of course he has cheap shot. And second chance. Okay. Are you wanting to die from the barrel, man? What are you doing? So we are able to do some damage. That's helpful. that again. He's not going to die, though, because he has... Oh, why did I move? He's got 42, and I, this will only do 40. Oh, my God, he's got two health. I'm going to put on the Walk in Darkness, because I don't want him to do any damage to him. to walk over here. Can I... I wonder if he can just... He'll just attack one if I just keep this out. I probably should have kept my other. I need to heal real quick. This fight's not going well. I probably should have just used that one power on him. Let me see if I can coerce him over here. Oh my god, he's going to do it. <laughs> I didn't think he would do it, but he did it. All right, cool. So that was Ordaz. <laughs> nice. It worked out. Use the AI. Osprey Totem? Okay. Yeah, you defeated yourself, man. You played yourself. Oh man, that was a little, got me a little nervous. Alright, we'll walk through this, this shouldn't take that long. Okay, man that fight, I just like that fight, this is an interesting fight. Um, especially with this challenge, it makes it a lot tougher. 
Because you can do that on fight pretty easily on any class at this level. That's not the issue. It's more of, hey, the issue here is this is a very companion oriented walkthrough and I just completely removed that. I removed the aspect of having companions. Okay, didn't get pulled. That's helpful. And the one at the front should have respawned by now. Yeah. I've also done this uh, dungeon a lot. Because so I have uh, Gornado, my Buccaneer. Y'all should see my Buccaneer here later this week. If not, you probably have seen it before this video. Alright. I mean, this is a very important scene. It's a very big scene, and I hope y'all will enjoy it. Look at this, we're in this really big crystally cave, so you know it's very important for the story. That really, it makes you think, doesn't it? Doesn't it makes you like, Eldorado? What's Eldorado? When are we going? Who Who is Eldorado? Why is Eldorado? But the real question is, can we defeat Gortez first try? Let me get this funky bunch right over here. Okay, um, so we're going in with this crew. I think we'll be fine with them. We've got good movement speed, which should help out. Um, but I think we're just going to go in. We're going to go in and hope for the best. we got good movement speed, so we should be able to get all these towers. So the main premise of this fight, if you haven't done it before, you have to use the four statues, and then Gortez comes down. And then when Gortez comes down, you can beat him up. Well, let me send you that way. Send you this way. I'm going to send all my companions out. Uh, can we get you to curl a bit? Yeah, cool. And I'm going to have the Buccaneers here. They don't do a super a lot of damage, but they have a big travel range. They can walk so far. So, I'm, this is going to be a, this is going to be a fight, that's for sure. Okay. I already told you, Rapier, did you not listen to my spiel? Come on, man. Okay. Let me distract this. That intercept power might be useful here. Dang, he's blocking. They're blocking Ratbeard's path. Hopefully, me being in the way acts as a little bit of a deterrent, so that way they'll go after Ratbeard. Those two guys are probably going to go after Fan, so hopefully Fan can absorb that damage. I think Bonnie's heal goes across the battle board, thankfully, but we'll see. See, they don't do a whole lot of damage. Good job, fan. Yeah, if you remember in the first episode of this series, the first levels of the game, you had to use these shrines. Um, do that. I'm actually going to let Rapbeard finish one of... Try to fight one of you guys. Just to get them off our tail. Maybe he'll kill one. I've got better movement speed. So I can hit that next round. Um, and then hopefully move back into range to get heals. I don't know how big Fan's going to be in this fight because of how far she is and how low her health is already. So I may wait to use a heal on her if I use one at all. Um... See this. I think it's gonna be mostly Bonnie and Rapier doing a lot of the damage. Alright. Alright, Gortez, please. Please be nice to me.
Okay, we got one of those guys gone, thankfully. So that's one less guy attacking Rapier. See, look at their range. It's crazy. And Gortez has a lot of decent powers, so... Good one. I think he has... I don't know if he has Relentless too. I know he has Relentless and Blade Storm. Okay, um, Bladestorm Relentless Vengeance Strike, cool, 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 let's go right here, I probably should move up actually, we're gonna move up, um, good thing you can hit him, Bonnie, you move up as well, um, is there anywhere, yeah, Rapier can go, hold on, let me click on me, I'm gonna go right here, Rapier, you wrap all the way around, oh, no, 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 you wrap around here, so that way your Bladestorm triggers. That was the best spot for you. Good one, Fan. Fan's gonna take the Vengeance Strike. Fan might die this round. I'm actually expecting Fan to die this round. But if we can get Gortez to half health, then that's really good. Good one, Ratbeard. They have flanking as well. Okay. Good one, Fan. Gortez is gonna get rid of Fan, but at least... Oh, no, okay. Well, maybe. You never know. You want fan? Okay, we're good. Uh, let's do this. Bonnie, you actually do one of those. And Gortez might be dead. He might be good. See a fan. Oh no, fan's still alive. Bonnie? Not bad at all. That fight went a lot better than I thought it would. Okay, Gortez is down. Man. So we got. Kerr's uniform. Ooh, I like that one. That's not bad. Okay, yeah, we defeated Gortez. So, first off. We did get a companion, who I'm going to keep in the main a little bit. Oh, I got some epic. Uh, we'll go for a double tap. Level 16, so we're going to keep him purely for that. Give him a rough. Give him a tough. Give him an agile. And that's all he gets. Cool, cool, cool. Okay, um... I'll see y'all when I'm at the Major Domo's Palace. Alright guys, we're back. Uh, I'm recording, right? Cool, cool, cool. Cool, cool, cool. Um, I was just looking. This jacket is snazzy. But with the pants that we have on with it, it really looks like we're kind of just... Oh, I guess the pants are kind of with it. But it just feels like we're no, we're not wearing any pants. And I really like that. This is a no-pants walkthrough. Okay, so that was cool. Ramba you get as a musketeer. Um, not that bad. I mean, not good at all. But not bad. And I think I'm going to end that there. Um, we made a lot of progress today. But next time... Ooh, a person. Uh, but next time, we should be making our way through Monquista. Short little world, but the second world of the game. Um, yeah, so that will be fun. That will be fun. Um, but if you enjoyed this video, please leave a like. If you didn't, please still leave a like, you know. It's all an ego thing here. But yeah, pretty good progress, and I'll see y'all next time. Have a good one.